Told Me by g Easy or in standard tuning. There's no capo. I'll be teaching you the chord progression that is played throughout the entire song. Um, this is a super basic version. We're just switching between two chords pretty much. There's actually three chords I'm going to teach you here, but it's really just a B minor and an F sharp minor. Those are the two main chords. And then we also have an A chord. <coughs> so, for a B minor chord, you're going to borrow your second fret from the fifth string down. Your middle finger is on the third fret of the B string. Ring finger is on the fourth fret of the D. Pinky is on the fourth fret of the G. If you can't play a bar chord, you can go ahead and um, just put your index on the second fret of the A string there. For an F sharp minor, you're going to borrow all the strings on the second fret. Ring finger is going to be on the fourth fret of the A. Pinky is on the fourth fret of the D. If you can't do the bar chords, you can just play the top three strings and your index is on the second fret of the low E. And that's it. So those are the two chords. Um, this A chord is played as well, so you should know that. So for an A chord, you have all your fingers sandwiched on that second fret there. So your middle is on the second fret of the D, ring fingers on the second fret of the G, pinkies on the second fret of the B string. And you play the A, D, G, B, E strings. And those are the three chords we're going to be working with. So we're going to start out in our B minor here. tricky here, but it goes down, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down. You do that once, then you switch to your F minor, your F sharp minor. to your B minor. And then after every third time, you can go to your A chord from the B minor. So to your F sharp. Back to your B minor. So the tough part here is that strumming pattern. So again, nice and slow here. And with the strings muted again. But other than that, you're really just switching between this B minor and your F sharp minor. And that's it. So. That's going to be it for this tutorial. I went through that pretty quickly, so if you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.